Charity begins at home. And I tell this story to everybody when they ask me, why do you collect things? The Hikino on PBS Hawaii 2023 Fall Challenge, supported by State Farm. In the high school division, receiving an honorable mention is Pearl City High School on Oahu. Congratulations. You take care of your family and yourself first before you spend money on stuff that's really not important to you having a good life. Over the past 60 years, Dennis Lee has amassed an impressive collection of everything, ranging from coins to trading cards to casino memorabilia. I've collected many things over the years. Then my last thing that I'm doing right now is casino memorabilia from the state of Nevada. This is a real nickel slot machine back in the day. <laughs> and I tell this story to everybody when they ask me, why do you collect things? The primary reason excuse I use or alibi that I use was when I was young, my parents were poor and we had no money. So I didn't get toys. Christmas time, you name it, toys were short on the short list. So I told myself when I got older and I had the money, I would buy my own toys. Things are much different today than what they were when he first started. The issue with collecting before uh, when I started was availability of resources to purchase items. So everything that you, if you wanted something, you had to physically go to a show or read magazines that were put out by people that sold certain products. And today, because of the internet, today is much easier to find anything you want. The Beatles album could be anywhere from 3,000 to 15,000, but you gotta find the buyer. See, anything you collect, this is the theory I use. It's worth nothing to somebody puts the money in your hand. I think Hawaii at one time had 12 stores. You actually had a physical place because no more internet, right? Those days never have internet. The only way to get it was to go to a physical store. Today, they're lucky there's two left. Because why? How can anybody stay in business? And why should I go to your store and buy something when I can buy it on the internet? So it could be cheaper than buying from a store. So naturally, all the stores sooner or later shut down. Well, he was the main character. He wasn't in the movie, but he did voiceovers. So I got his autograph. It took me 15 years to get all these autographs. There's no comparison today to go buy a collectible versus then. This is Rika Marie Regassa from Pearl City High School on the island of Oahu, reporting for Hikino on PBS Hawaii. State Farm would like to congratulate all of the winners of the Hikino on PBS Hawaii 2023 Fall Challenge for their outstanding work and amazing storytelling.